think overall we're pl feeling pretty pretty good. I mean, uh, our goal was to try to play well heading into the tournament, and I think for the most part over the last two weeks we've played very, very well, um, minus maybe the first half of the UTEP game on uh, Saturday. But I'll tell you what, I'll take our fight that we had in the third and fourth quarter of that game um, anytime. So uh, that's what it's going to take for us, playing, you know, having to go down and win four games in a row. The biggest thing is just we have to compete and we have to fight. Well, yeah, I mean, that's the truth. Uh, but, you know, I, I'm not sure that that's really our focus, to be honest. I mean, I think that's everybody, everybody else focuses that way coming into a tournament. But for us, it's more positive, like what can we do today to play the best that we can play and uh, not worrying about tomorrow because tomorrow's not promised. So I think that's the number one thing for us is how can we compete at a high level? How can we rebound the ball really well? How can we play the best defense that we've played all year? Because those are the keys to me. We're going to be able to score, I think, uh, most of the time. But you know, if we can't rebound, if we can't play defense and we can't compete at a high level, um, it doesn't matter what, how many points we score. Oh, absolutely. I mean, I think anytime you play a team three times, uh, certainly it's usually a lot more competitive. But um, I think Marshall's a really dangerous team. Uh, they shoot the three really well. They run a lot of different stuff offensively, so they're hard to prepare for, even though we've seen them two times already. And uh, they traditionally play well in the tournament. I mean, they've knocked people off the last couple of years. So um, certainly cannot take that, um, take them lightly at all. And if we do, then we deserve to come home. Uh, it's probably a better question to ask Grace Hunter when you see her next, but because uh, I would prefer not to operate in that way. Um, but I do think I think that goes back to I've talked about this team for the majority of this season. I think that they're fighters. You know, we went through maybe two or three weeks in February where we didn't have that fight, and I don't know the reason why we didn't. But for the rest of this season, from October until now, this team has fought really hard to prove themselves, to win games, um, to try to just continue to elevate this program. And I think that's overall the personality of this team. So when they do find themselves for whatever reason in those holes in games, I think collectively they always believe that they can fight back. Okay. Yeah, I think that's the most difficult thing for young people, uh, 18 to 22 year olds, when you're working with them is getting them to focus in a conference tournament one game at a time, especially when you beat the team twice. So those conversations have already been had today. They will be can continue to be had tomorrow. And, um, you know, and I'll be honest, I don't think my team has done that well in past years, that we've been a higher seed. We've kind of walked in and thought we were going to win, and we've lost games like this. And so that's – my antenna is completely up about that. I hope at this point in time we have good enough leaders and Sierra and Lefty and Grace and, you know, everyone else to just set that tone really early that we have to earn everything we get now. Yeah, I mean, it was an incredible game. I know as a coach, uh, it was fun for me to just watch her on the sidelines because of the way that she competed. And um, we have great seniors on this team. We have great juniors on this team. But this team is slowly becoming uh, Grace's team, you know, not just because of the stats that she puts up, but they're adopting her personality uh, in a lot of ways, I think, which is to enjoy the game, but to compete at a really high level. Um, and you can see that in the way that they play, in my opinion. You know, she celebrates almost every single play to default. I'm screaming at her to get back on defense. <laughs> but our, our team generally does that too. And I think they've just it's kind of rubbed off on everybody, and it's a fun way to play. Um, but I do think, you know, I think Grace always plays with a lot of confidence. But I, I think uh, when she plays like that, it helps our overall team confidence because they really believe in her. And I think everybody, you know, knows that she's one of the best players in Conference USA. I feel real confident. I feel like the games that we lost, the close games, I feel like we're going to end up being on top in those games as long as we work hard in practice. Yeah, we just got to go into the game knowing that we got to still go hard even if we beat them already twice this year. But I don't know. They're a good team. I know it's kind of weird, but I really don't get nervous. I'm just more excited, like, let's do this. Like That's always my mood about every game. Yeah, we always talk about just coming into games ready. And we feel like if we keep doing this and coming in slow, we're going to get stat hit in the back. Like, it's going to be bad. So I just encourage me, me, myself, and my teammates just to come in ready for, in every single game in this for Alabama.